And if you're looking for other ways to help someone during the holidays, you can look within yourself and start with your smartphone by reaching out to that special senior in your life. I did just that with my own grandmother for Christmas, and you can do the same for the rest of this holiday season. COVID-19 and its safety precautions are taking a negative toll mentally and physically on our seniors. Healthcare experts say they feel lonely, so this Christmas, I wanted to make sure that my grandmother doesn't feel that way. Health experts say all it takes is a Zoom or FaceTime call to boost their energy. Do you like it, Grandma? Mm -hmm. This is my grandma, Frankie Steverson. She is my Zodiac twin and one of the most important people in my life. 2020 is her first Christmas away from all of her grandchildren. I miss my grandchildren, but I'm about to be a great grandmother. And I love them, and I know they love me. But because of COVID-19, we cannot be together. My grandmother is over the age of 65 with underlying health issues, making her vulnerable to catching COVID-19. She is a breast cancer survivor. Because I'm a breast cancer survivor, my immune system is low. That's why I'm not visiting so much this year. I'm five years in, and thank God for that. But I'm still stepping. My grandma has always been the life of any party, and when she's with her twin, Francis, it's double trouble for everyone. This has been an uncomfortable year. It's just my daughter and I celebrating Christmas with my children and grandchildren away. Grandma, your kids and grandkids want you to know how much they love you. Merry Christmas, Mom. I wish I was close to you, and I love you very much. Hi, Mom. I'm just letting you know how much I love you and to wish you a wonderful and joyful Merry Christmas. Merry Christmas, Grandma. I miss you and I love you. Just wish you a Merry Christmas, Grandma. Wish we could spend it with you. We love you and we miss you. This is not just about Christmas. This is about every day. About sharing your love, hope, faith, and grace. That amazing grace for everyone. God bless. From the Steverson family, I hope that you all have a very Merry Christmas. In Lafayette, I'm Princess Jeanne Steverson Lowry, News 15. Healthcare experts say for a better and longer life expectancy, reach out to all of your loved ones and frequently finding creative ways to connect with others is probably the best medicine, especially after the year we have all dealt with.